Good morning. It's uh, the 22nd of July and uh, I'm just about to start the Camino for real. Um, I had a reasonably good night's sleep here at this uh, uh, lovely hotel in St. Jean. Um, in the night, the thunder and lightning and rain was unreal. Um, it, it felt like um, it was going to uh, take the roof off. It really did, and it didn't happen just once, it happened twice, and uh, yeah, it was like some sort of uh, fearful or uh, foreboding of the trip ahead. It was a little bit intimidating, and uh, some of the other guests over breakfast also uh, mentioned the same. Met some nice people uh, this morning, and um, yeah, just sort of making final preparations before uh, heading off. Filled up the water bottles. Um, it's a fine balancing act between taking water and adding another three kilograms to carry. So, uh, yeah, we'll see how that goes. Um, wasn't able to upload anything yesterday. The uh, Wi-Fi, as we say in, in Europe, uh, wasn't quite uh, able to cope with uh, YouTube. So, um, I'm all done. Feet are strapped up. Uh, special glide moisturizing anti-rub stuff is uh, put on my feet so hopefully I should be all right but it's 25.1 kilometers today pretty much uphill like that so we'll see how I get on okay just to give you a little idea here we are St. Jean I'm going to be following that uh, orange dotted line all the way up here to, I believe we say, Ronchevalles, and that is in Spain. Midway point, you can see the Spain-France border, and uh, just to give you an idea of the gradient, here we start in St. Jean, we go up, we go up, and then back down again. All good fun. About seven hours? Mm. So that's it, I've got my first uh, stamp and uh, I'm heading out now and this is it, this is the first step on the Camino. Just got my stamp from back there, my hotel was just up the road there, uh, got a walking stick, I've decided to uh, go up the mountain route. It's only six hours to the top, it's half seven now, so uh, the guy said the weather's going to be alright. So I better get a move on. Buen Camino. So I've been walking for about half an hour. You probably can't see in the background though. The the Pyrenees. That's what I'm going to have to walk up. And uh lurking uh, menacingly behind that uh fog. Um with the rain last night and the heat, it's a little bit like being in a botanic garden. It's hot and very very humid um, so uh, hopefully I don't get run over here but uh, yeah, just uh, keep plodding along drinking plenty of water uh, there's only three places along the way you can get water so I'll have to be mindful of that but uh, I've not even started yet and uh, wow I'm absolutely uh, soaking with sweat so better keep drinking so I keep uh, I keep seeing these little red signs underneath the Camino signs and uh, <laughs> they've got a little gradient on them and uh, it says 65 degrees. I'm assuming that's warnings that at certain points the gradients are 65 degrees. Uh, just stood to one side to let a lorry pass by and uh, as I was watching it try and get up the hill started to skid and come back down the hill towards me well a little bit I, was, I would have got out of the way but uh, just goes to show how steep it is anyway um, I'll stop panting into the camera and uh, get on with it so this is me up in the uh, the clouds this is pretty much what it's been like all day uh, there are quite a few pilgrims around see people and then uh, then they're gone again uh, little 
little cairns and things like this are around all the time. And little, uh, I don't know if you can see that. Those little things telling you uh, which way to go and to keep going. Yeah, it's very tiring. Just I'm just taking the uh, uh, sort of uh, keep going like a slow, very slow tortoise. Uh, have little breaks, like a couple of minutes here, a couple of minutes there. Uh, there was an albergue a little while back, uh, or cafe rather, and uh, just stayed for about 15 minutes, had a drink, drink of water, didn't dare sit down. My legs are killing, okay? But anyway, must press on. Ciao for now. So it's uh, just turning two o'clock. I've been walking since 7.30 this morning. Uh, I don't think I've got more than an hour left. Uh, it's just, it doesn't give up. Just the moment you think it's evening off, it takes you up and down again. So there may well be an easy bit. That's only relative to uh, the first five hours or so, which were brutal absolutely brutal uh, but uh, yeah as it's raining I'll uh, turn off my phone and uh, put it away <laughs>